What's going on everyone? Welcome to another Screen Sanctum Reaction. I'm Steve. Today I'm going to react to the new trailer to the movie Saturday Night that comes out this year. It stars J.K. Simmons, Willem Dafoe, among some other actors um, that I've really never heard of besides Finn Wolford. I believe this movie takes place the night of the very first airing of Saturday Night Live, so it's everything that happened leading up to that moment, and maybe we'll see a little bit of the show, but besides that information, that's all I really have. But before I get into this one, if you want to see my full uncut reactions to all my videos, please check out my Patreon. I got something for everyone there. All right, here we go. Saturday night in three, two, one, go. Hey, free comedy show, plenty of seats. Hmm. Plenty of tickets left, guys. Couldn't even give them away. Fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, there's Finn. What guild it ate. So, big night. Yep. Look, my name is Lorne Michaels. I'm the producer of Saturday Night. The whole night? <laughs> yeah, the whole night. <laughs> and no one knows who he is yet. Gilda Radner. And I ain't got... How the fuck do you pronounce this? <laughs> really? He couldn't... That was Paul Schaefer, right? You know, I was thinking... Supposed to be. Why don't we punt? We should run the dress rehearsal and claw back a win next Saturday. We can't, Dick. It's a live show. Mm-hmm. We're just not ready. Doesn't matter that we're ready. It matters that it's 11.30. That's when we go on. <laughs> Lauren, all I'm trying to do is give you advice. It's in everyone's best interest, mainly yours. Mm -hmm. All right, was that a threat? Fuck around, Lauren. You haven't locked the script. Willem. Who is in open rebellion? Fuck you! <laughs> fuck you! I definitely fuck you. Oh, the God. writers on the 17th floor tied a belt around Big Bird's neck and hung him from my dressing room. Is that door. supposed to be Jim Henson? <laughs> what? So tell me how you fit into this ensemble. Oh, is this an ensemble? Really? Yeah. Fuck you! NBC makes more money playing reruns of The Tonight Show. NBC is lucky to have something as relevant as this show. One they don't even want. And it's That's still lucky. on, fuck. All to be here. I mean, we're 90 minutes of live television by a group of 20-year-olds who've never made anything. <laughs> Do you ever stop and wonder why they said yes? A counterculture show starring total unknowns <laughs> with zero narrative and even less structure. Oh, I'm curious as to why they said yes. <laughs> They want you to fail. Oh. All right. Who was he back then that they wanted him to fail? You have to make it to air. Am I still in the show? That's got to be Chevy Chase. Nice. Sorry. Tripped over my penis. Yeah, definitely. Definitely Chevy Chase. October 11th. So who was Lorne Michaels back then? What significance did he have that would make NBC want him to fail? I don't really know much about him besides that he's the guy who created Saturday Night Live and he's still there. And they do have, I know, a movie studio because most of the movies that have SNL cast members in it that aren't like huge movie stars are SNL productions like that. I know. But going by this trailer, there are a lot of actors in here that I don't remember the names of the characters. Like I'm not quick enough to be like, oh, that's. So and so, that's Dan Aykroyd, that's Chevy Chase. But I could see their faces and how their makeup and their hair is done, and I, I recognize them all. Like they did a really good job of casting this. So I'm just gonna look at the cast list now, just to see like who we know is gonna be in it as a cast member that I've heard of. But like J.K. Simmons, we saw him really quickly. He's playing Milton Berle. That's pretty good. Uh, Ella Hunt is playing Gilda Radner, and she was the one with the the puffy hair. Looks really, really good. Nicholas Braun as Jim Henson. I called that one out. I mean, that one was easy because they, they mentioned Big Bird, but I had a feeling that was Jim Henson. Gabriel LaBelle as Lorne Michaels. Um, Corey Michael Smith as Chevy Chase. We knew that was him at the end, obviously. Kim Matula as Jane Curtin. Uh, who else? I don't have really, not everyone on this cast list. And there were definitely more people in here that I recognized by like how well they were cast, but it's interesting. It's actually a story. I know a lot of people will say, who wants a movie about Saturday Night Live? This really isn't a movie about Saturday Night Live. Like this is something for, I guess, someone maybe my age or a little bit older who I watched it like in the 90s when Chris Farley was on. I don't watch it so much now. I personally think that was the best time <laughs> that uh, it ran. But obviously people older than me probably think it was like this time with the original cast because they were unknowns, as I said, but the original cast 
they're like mega superstars. Like everyone knew who they were after this. Like, so even though I like the nineties, I would probably have to admit that as far as like iconic casts, it was probably the early days. Like you, it, it's like almost everyone back then was good. You know, in the nineties and two thousands and now there are a couple of people, like a handful that are really stars. And then there are some that are just on there, you know, they'll be in a skit every now and then. It just, it just felt like back then everyone was a star. Again, that was back then. This is interesting to see what actually went into the first night of Saturday Night Live. Like, it's really cool. I know it's going to be embellished and probably added more drama. I don't know. It very well could have gone smoothly and they just wanted to add some drama for this movie, but I don't know. But I think it'll be good. I, I really think this is going to be a pretty fun movie. Um, I don't think it's going to be like a $500 million movie. It doesn't have to be. But I think it'll be good. I, I really think this is something that might interest a lot of people. You know, if you watch Saturday Night Live now or you ever did, you'd probably want to know what the hell happened on that first night. Like, how did this even come to be? Like a live sketch show? I mean, I know there were sketch shows way before Saturday Night Live, but none have been on for like 50 years or whatever it's been, like SNL has been. So it's like, what made this so successful and how did they start? And that's what intrigues me. And I feel like it'll intrigue um, a lot of people out there. That's just my thought. What did you all think of this trailer or my reaction and my thoughts? And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace, guys.